Hi guys, this is Rishabh Kapoor from websofttutorials.com. In this video guys, I'm gonna show you that how can you make your own jQuery drop-down menu. You can see this menu. I have applied a fade effect to this menu. You can apply slide effect. You can apply hide show effect. So guys, in this video, I'm, I'll show you that how can you make this. So let's begin guys. Firstly guys, I'll make a another list. with uh, five list items now firstly I'll write uh, home about us uh, services facts and then contact us Firstly, guys, I'll open it in browser. You can see this is our unordered list. And firstly, I'll set the styling of this unordered list. So for that, guys, I'll go to st inside style text and I write ul. And firstly, guys, I'll set its margin to zero and padding to zero. Then I'll remove this uh, list style. So I'll set list style none. Can see the bullets have been removed now guys I'll write ul space li then I'll set it firstly I'll set its float property float uh, to left then I'll give it a width of 150 pixels and height of uh, 30 pixels and I'll give it a line height of 30 pixels. Let's refresh now. I can see. Now I'll align the text at the center. So I'll write text align center. Refresh now. I can see it's centered now. Now I'll get a background color. So I'll write background. I'll get a, give it a background color of red. So I'll write FF0000, which is a uh, code of uh, red color. So now I'll write ULLIA because uh, this is anchor tag which we have applied. So I'll write so I'll write sorry text decoration text decoration to none refresh. Now I can see the underline has has been removed and I'll give it a color of white refresh I can see it's in white color now guys we will make the uh, uh, sublinks you can see so for that I write ul li to 4 and uh, guys I wanna tell you that I'm using Zen coding that's why I'm using this short code. So I'll write link one, link two, link three, and uh, link four. Where if I refresh now, I can see it's link one, two, three, four. Now, in the same way, I'll use this another list uh, inside list tag. So I'll write U L space L I. Multiply by four and then a. So I'll write link one, link two, link three, and then link four. So refresh now. I can see this is another uh, sublist of uh, this home list item, and these are the uh, sublinks of this about us list items. I'm not going to apply to this. Uh, sublinks to all the list items so we will uh, uh, convert it into a uh, drop down menu jQuery drop down menu so for that guys firstly I'll set its styling of this uh, list tag so I'll write ul space li then space li now firstly I'll give it a background color of uh, ff0000 then color of uh, white you see color of white now 
I'll set the property of anchor tag. So I'll write ul space li space li space a. Then I'll text decoration to none. And then I'll give it a color of uh, FFF, which is a uh, white color. Then I'll set its hover property. So I'll copy it and I'll write ULLI LI then hover means when I will hover my mouse over it. Then I'll give it a background color of hash 444. Sorry, I'll write 555. Five, five. So refresh. Firstly, I'll check it. When I hover my mouse, we have see it's applying this color now firstly guys I'll hide it for that I'll write display to none refresh now I can see it's hidden guys what I will do when I hover my mouse over home tag or oh, sorry home uh, this list item or this is list item it will be displayed using jQuery effect so for that guys I will go inside document or writing function uh, guys I want to tell you that this is not a jQuery UI drop down menu so we need just jQuery library files sorry we need just one jQuery library file which is a 1.9 version you can use any version so for that case firstly I'll write inside document or writing functions so firstly I'll write li dot hover means and I, uh, I'll make the function for this hover uh, so I'll write function means when I hover my mouse over this list item then what it would do so I'll write this dot find means it will find for something so I'll write single quotes ul greater than sign then li then dot whatever which effect you want to apply so I'll write uh, fade toggle guys I want to tell you that this fade toggle is in camel case means T is capital so I'll write two seconds or oh, sorry I'll apply four seconds refresh you can see I'll increase the speed sorry it's 400 I have applied 4000 you can see this is uh, fade effect has been applied now guys I want to tell you uh, how this is working guys when I hover my mouse over list tag this list tag this list tag now then it will find for another list means when I hover my mouse over this home then it will find for uh, another list which is inside that list tag means which is the uh, it will look for a children another list with some list items then when I hover my mouse over this it will look for uh, children list items then it will check if it is displayed then it will hide it if it is hidden then it will display it now you can see we can so guys we have made this jQuery drop down menu but here is the problem in it when you hover your mouse over it again and again you will see this when I hover my mouse over it again and again and when I will take it back you will you will see it's uh, still working because it's creating a queue creating a queue because if I hover my mouse over it for 10 times it will display it for 10 times whether I have taken my mouse back so in order to get rid of this problem we will do one thing so we'll go to uh, top and uh, after this bracket so, uh, after this bracket I will apply dot stop function that's it if uh, now I will refresh you will see when I hover it again and again and when I take my mouse back it will uh, it will stop this another list to it will stop the jQuery to make a queue so guys this was about jQuery drop down menu so guys if you have any question in your mind then you can leave a comment below thanks for watching this video guys don't forget to subscribe my channel to get recent updates about our videos let's see in the next tutorial